Hey, I just wanted to tell you about the radioactive shrimp that was being sold at Walmart. Specifically, it was contaminated with cesium-137. It was detected in the shipping containers, although it still went out to market. So there was a flaw in the distribution system. It shouldn't have been packaged and sold. I've been reading a lot of articles about it, and typically when you have radioactive seafood, it's a result of something like nuclear contamination because cesium-137 is a byproduct of nuclear reactors. A lot of nuclear reactors do use things like ocean water and river water to actually cool them. So if there's a leak at the origin, that could be a reason and it should raise alarm bells. No one is entirely sure how it got there and it was out of Indonesia. It could have been something in the packaging. Nonetheless, you will not get superpowers if you eat it. So if you have great value shrimp, I would just throw it away. There are other ways that this could happen because the world has dumped a whole lot of radioactive waste in the ocean thinking that it would just dilute it. And those areas have the potential to leak and contaminate our food products. And you know, the ocean. That place where we've already lost 80% of total fish biomass in the last 100 years? Yes, that's 80%, not 18%. Fortunately, it does look like the levels are pretty low, and the fact that it got recalled at all does make me happy because it means the FDA is working in some way, shape, or form, even though, you know, it caught it a little bit late. You can go to Walmart and get a refund for recalled products. Just check the FDA's website. You will not get superpowers.